Butte High School isn't going to let a little COVID-19 pandemic ruin its graduation ceremony. The question now is, how do you do it safely? MTN's John Amy is live right now in our Butte studio with more on that question. John. That's right, Kevin. You know, high school graduation is, a, is one of the biggest milestones in a young person's life. So Butte officials want Butte High seniors to experience it, but with an abundance of caution. Officials with the Butte Health Department and the Butte Civic Center want to make sure Butte High students have a safe graduation ceremony because an event like this is too important to cancel. But this is a big deal for the graduates. They've been going to school since they were in kindergarten, 12 years. You know, not everybody goes on to college. For some people, this will be their only graduation. And it's a, it's a major milestone in people's lives. Butte's 250 graduates will each have a six foot circumference of space between them on the floor of the Civic Center. There will be no band or choir, and they're calling for a short commencement address. And they will call the graduates up and hand them the diploma. There won't be any handshaking, of course. There will be somebody here taking pictures. Each graduate will be restricted to two guests for a total of 500 guests. And there's going to be reserve seating for each of the guests with at least four seats of separation between each pair of guests. We're talking about tickets today. What I foresee happening is reserve seats because we have our seats, of course, are all numbered and the Butte High School will distribute them to the graduates for their two people that can come. And Butte High's uh, graduation will be on May 27th and Butte Central will have their graduation on May 17th at St. Anne's Catholic Church.